In this video, we're going to look at how we can simplify radicals with higher indexes than just 2 when they don't come out evenly. In this first example, we've got the cube root of 54, and with a little bit of guess and check, you might find that nothing to the third power comes out to 54, at least not nicely, and so we'll simplify it in much the same way we simplified square roots. Take out what we can, and leave the rest behind inside the radical. And the way we did that is we found the prime factorization of 54. 54 is divisible by 2, 2 times 27. 27 is divisible by 3, 3 times 9. And 9 is divisible by 3, 3 times 3. The only difference now is because we have a cube root, we're looking for sets of 3. It takes 3 matches to come out of the radical, rather than 2 with the square root. Here we have a triplet of 3's. This means outside of the cube root, don't lose the index, we need a 3. And left inside the radical is a 2. This becomes our simplified result. The cube root of 54 is the same as 3 times the cube root of 2. Let's try another example. In the second example, we have 3 times the 4th root of 48. And again, nothing to the 4th power comes out to 48, so let's find the prime factorization. 48 is divisible by 2, 24 times. 24 is divisible by 2, 12 times. 12 is divisible by 2, 6 times. 6 is divisible by 2, 3 times. And we finally have all prime numbers left under the radical. Again, it's important we look at the index. We're looking for groups of 4. We have 1, 2, 3, four twos under that radical. Because we have a group of four, we bring it outside as a solid two, and don't forget the three that was in front of everything. Three times the radical, three times the two. What's left inside the radical is just the number three. And so when we multiply the three times two, we get six times the fourth root of three for our final solution. Again, to simplify with higher index, we find the prime factorization by dividing out all the prime factors, and then we use the index to determine how big of a group we need to pull something out of the radical.